we have been called to be a house of prayer and in praying we learn something about Jesus everything that Jesus did was centered around praying that was why his disciples never said to him teach us how to preach teach us how to reach the homeless they said teach us how to pray I love prayer because the mighty, mighty men of old, they were powerful not because they, they were intelligent. They were powerful not because they could preach. They were powerful because they knew how to go on their knees. They knew how to pray. I love the Lord's prayer because when they came to Jesus, they said, teach us how to pray. And the response of Jesus is, you pray like this. So it occurred to me that praying is not what we talk about. Praying is what we do. And that is why today we've decided that this day once a month we're going to pray it's not going to be about spectators it's not going to be about me praying and you listening it's going to be us corporately praying and saying to the heavens that are bronze right now open up heaven so that we can have revival open up skies open up heaven so that souls can be saved i can never convict anybody I am not the Holy Spirit. Men and women are slipping into hell every day without knowing Jesus. But we can pray and have the heavens open and have the Holy Spirit through our prayer convict men and women and bring them into the heart of God. Bring them into the presence of God. So right now, we are going to pray. We're going to pray together. We're going to pray as one and we're going to invite the Holy Spirit. Just like the disciples, they said, teach us to pray. And he said, you pray like this, our Father who is in heaven. So we're going to say, Jesus, be in our midst as we pray these prayers right now. Let us pray. <laughs> 